Well, on a lighter note for you, Olympians and Olympic hopefuls are passing through our state on their journey to Paris. The canoe slalom Olympic trials got underway this morning in Montgomery. WVTM 13's Emma Owen made the trek south to check it out. Fans all smiles, cheering loudly as world-class kayakers and canoeists race down these rapids. Support Jed Hinckley, competition director for the American Canoe Association, says means a lot to these competitors. Oftentimes these athletes are competing, you know, at venues where it's largely just coaches, officials, and their parents. Um, you know, it varies from location to location, so I know for them it's really special and really exciting to be able to compete in front of, uh, you know, hundreds of people, thousands of people. Hinkley hopes seeing these athletes in action will inspire the younger generation, which is exactly why Carrie Carlson brought her family. My husband and I had three boys and we wanted to bring them out, show them what the Olympics are about, what sporting is about, persistence and hard work, um, and what it takes to get to this level of competition. She and Kate Taliafaro reflecting on these life lessons as they sit just feet away from all the excitement. And to be able to sit right next to the water and to just cheer on these amazing athletes that we didn't really know a whole lot about. We're learning about a whole new sport today, which is really exciting. Charity Borg and her husband Zach are in the same boat. It's really awesome. Great to see uh, the Olympic trials. Definitely not something we've seen before, and we love water sports. So we wanted to, this guy to see some of the top athletes, which is yeah. really fun. And it's just getting started. Competition continues tomorrow morning at Montgomery Whitewater, and just like today, these events are free to watch. Tomorrow we'll have the second day of Solom, and, the, and then that's followed by a head-to-head -head event where the kayak cross athlete, athletes are going down the river at the same time in plastic boats, which is like what people can try here. And they're actually bumping into each other and it's kind of a, a like a, kind of not a free for all. There are rules, but uh, it's head to head and it's really exciting. So people should definitely come out and watch that. Awards will immediately follow before athletes pack up and prepare for the next round of trials in Oklahoma City. On the road to Paris, I'm Emma Owen.